we're going to a different place, which is a new normal. 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 New normal. Embrace the new normal. 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 This new normal is going to look very, very different. Not normal, but a new normal. The new normal. New normal. There will be a new normal. A new normal. New normal. A new normal. The new normal. A new normal. This is the new normal. This is our new normal. Our new normal. A new normal. Our new normal. New normal. The new normal. Our new normal. We will transition into the new normal. This will be the new normal until a vac. Welcome to the Crypto Teacher. And guys, please like and subscribe. If you do like what you're listening to, please inform your friends and family and spread it all over social media. It is imperative that we get back to learning finances and understand how the world really works. Because once we understand how the world really works, we understand that everything is planned out. Now, guys, I want to thank those who purchased the books, Crypto Teacher and W.O. Book. Also, those who have donated to the Cash App, much love. Keep it coming. Also, Patreon, keep it coming. Also, those who purchased from the store, you've been blowing the store up and the Cash App up. Thanks a lot. Now, guys, I want to thank you so much. We have broken records as far as the views are concerned. So basically the views are up over 1500%. So as far as the views are concerned, uh, you may not see a high uh, view amount in each video, but people are looking at tons of videos at one time. So they just don't watch one video. They keep watching more and more videos. So that's because of you sharing the video so i want to thank you a whole lot now guys we're going to get into bitcoin and cryptos first now guys what did we see what did i tell you about indicators we saw xrp do what go up the rest of the market went up we saw the volume go up the volume didn't push up extremely high so we just took a little tick up now guys don't forget we have back so we know they said they had a great futures so we know that what we are going to take a little dip. We don't know how much that dip is, but we are going to take a dip. So do not get caught in the fake out. The volume, the volume went up, but it's not a vo enough volume there. You can look at Bitcoin's volume, XRP volume. Look at the volume. It's not up where it normally is when we're actually going to go up five hundred to a thousand dollars. It's not there. Uh, but just like I said, guys, we have the Fed cutting a check tomorrow. Also, just like I stated, we have back. So make sure we are paying attention to dates. Now, also the indicators. Remember, stable coins went down. XRP went up. Of course, the market went up. So stable coins, XRP, and volume. That is our indicators. Now, guys, starting in September, remember I stated dates are so, so important. If you have my book, you understand this. Uh... 9-11 happened on Hebrew New Year's, guys. 90, don't forget that. So the fact is that New Year's is not in January. It's not. New Year's is not in January. New Year's is in September. So normally we have Jubilee in September. So we know for a fact that basically the markets are going to start as correction. We know for a fact the bull market of crypto start in September. We have XRP court date is going to end somewhere at the end of this month, beginning of September. So we start the bull market. Are we going to still have ups and downs? Yes, but I'm going to get into that, guys. Now, remember, we have Blockstream working on Bitcoin Lightning. We had David Swartz, remember, discuss that. Also, getting on that second layer. Remember, the Bitcoin is not really moving. Is this the IOU on that second layer? So don't forget about that. And XRP, once Bitcoin hits 14,000, what happens to XRP? It normally hits 50 cents. So that is definitely coming. Now, we're gonna, I'm going to get into the news to put this all in together. Something that we forgot about. And those who are new to the channel that have not checked out the video, Digital Wallet, please go look at that. That is my must-watch videos. I'm going to re-put that in the description. But guys, we have a Banking for All Act. Remember, that was introduced June 30th of 2020. 
basically goes over the digital wallets the Federal Reserve. The banks have until January 2021 to give all residents uh, in the United States a digital wallet. Now, you say, okay, you know, we've been talking a lot about that. In the actual act, guys, it has the Postal Service having automated tellers to maintain as far as the board of directors for the actual Postal Service. So the Postal Service will handle these digital wallets for the Federal Reserve. Now we see what's going on with the Postal Service right now. That's all you've been hearing from Trump when he got into office that the Postal Service is losing money. The Postal Service is losing money. We know UPS, FedEx, their stocks are going up. We know Amazon is now delivering. So we have all these companies delivering their own items or contracting out UPS and FedEx. We know USPS is losing money, the United States Postal Service. So think about it, guys. How about if the United States Postal Service becomes your digital banks. Think about it, guys. It's not going to be people in there. It's just going to be automatic tellers that are going to be in there. And everybody has access to a postal service. I'm just giving you something to think about, guys. And that's also going to be in my book in part three. Part three is going to be coming out uh, basically in January 2021 because that's when the foot gets put on the gas and I want to make sure everybody knows where we're going but the digital wallets have until January 2021 and then basically remember they're stalling on this payments for the people so think about it if they get the payments in September so you have September October November December January February so you know six months February, these people will no longer get any more money. So we know the digital wallets take effect when January 2021. We know probably in March or April, universal basic income or cryptos come about. What happens? You created the problem. You wait on the reaction. And fe uh, in February, you come in with the solution March or April. So basically, universal basic income will be introduced. And what happens? The government is in total control. They're just airdropping people money. Think about it, guys. Now, basically, I'm going to get over into crypto news, guys. We have Bitcoin and Tesla, the most popular assets on uh, TradingView in July. We also had a whole lot of records in July. I'm going to go over that. We had Gemini ad support for uh, Hong Kong, Australian, and Canadian dollar. Uh, we had 21 shares exchange. Uh, the exchange traded products, ETP, crosses 100 million for assets. Uh, basically, we had Germany is quickly becoming the world uh, crypto superpower. Basically, what they're doing is that they're one of the few countries that are laying down regulation early. So, guys, we know the EU, the European Union, we know that uh, the euro is very new, guys, when it comes to other currencies. So, we know that they're going to do the digital and also they're going to be attached to China Yuan. Remember I told you that. Uh, we have Curves becomes the third DeFi to lock in, 1 billion value. Also going to go over that a little later also. Uh, we have the fan tokens provide Visa cards. Now, we had Binance CZ saying DeFi is the future. So we have a lot of people in the crypto space that don't understand DeFi. So guys, definitely do your research. DeFi is definitely going to be the future. But we also see what? More centralized exchanges becoming the norm. And we know these exchanges are owned by who? these big banks. They just behind the scenes. And we know Binance is owned by China, so we know they control that. But we also had Binance see its highest traffic in July. Uh, basically getting over into world news, guys. We have uh, hedge funds hit 4,000% returns, guys. 
4,000 percent returns. Why is that? 85 percent of the stock market is owned by who? The top 10 percent. Guys, they know when it's going up and down. They know this. So we must take advantage of these stocks. I have a surprise in September. I'm not going to announce it yet. I have a surprise in September. And I'll probably announce it at the end of this month. Uh, but also we had Morgan Creek says that uh, Warren Buffett is going to start buying Bitcoin. Guys, you don't have to buy Bitcoin in order to invest in the crypto technology. We already know Buffett is already in the crypto space. We know Energy Web Token. We know he's in the energy. We know V Chain. We know he's into the supply chain. So, guys, we know that you don't have to direct invest directly in order to be invested in the crypto space. So, we already know Warren Buffett already has his hand. And remember, Warren Buffett is just an agent for the Rothschilds. That's it. But, guys, that's all I have for you. I want to thank you a lot again for the views. Uh, basically, our views are just as high as people with 100 and 200,000 subscribers. And that's what it's all about. Getting the message out. Keep doing it, guys. Keep pushing this message so we can wake the masses, guys. Please. Now, don't forget about the books, Crypto Teacher and your book. Also, if you're new to cryptos, Coinbase, Bitch, you Binance. Also, your stocks, Cobalt, Chip Stocks, Gaming, Banking. Also, guys, everybody sitting at home, don't forget about those stocks. You have the C word, guys. Don't get confused. It's all a distraction. Don't fall for it. But definitely, and those who are falling for it, invest. Don't forget about the C word stocks, the biotech stocks. Also, guys, people are sitting at home doing what? Waiting on that free money. So what are they doing? Drinking and smoking weed. Don't forget about those stocks. And y'all have a wonderful day.